In this short demonstration, I'm going to show you some advanced screening techniques that you can use against your watch lists and portfolios. We happen to be looking at the Volume Percent Advances page in the stock section. This page shows today's stocks whose current volume compared to their 20-day average volume has increased. Now wouldn't it be nice to know if any of these stocks are currently things that you are watching on a watch list or that you've already placed onto a portfolio? I'm going to click the screen icon and it brings the list of volume advances into the stock screener for me to take a look at. If I look at the results, it's the same list of symbols that I was just looking at on the volume advances page. Under the filter grouping called My Lists and Profile, you are going to find a selection for watch lists and also for portfolios. By selecting one or more of your watch lists, I'm going to show things that are found on that Volume Advances page that are already in my watch list. And I can go back and select more watch lists if I'd like and then further analyze the results using either a custom view or with your flip charts. If you'd like, you can save the screener so you can run this exact setup again, or save the results to a new watch list. This new feature that allows you to screen on one or more watch lists and portfolios against other bar chart lists and against the extensive set of filters that are available to you within the screeners is a real advantage when you think about narrowing down the markets that you are looking at for possible trade selection.